For anybody who follows my social media, you'll know that I'm a pretty firm believer in positive and negative energies kind of manifesting themselves. And I like to be a purveyor of this positive energy, a manifestation of that energy, so to speak. But when you're fucking coming at me like you guys did. So yeah, you can see the post here. Posted it 12 hours ago from this moment. It's got downvoted quite a lot with uh, 276 views or 2% upvoted. And as you can see, it's literally just me, you know, going and doing a, an exercise, doing some ladders, doing these tire lifts, doing some pistol squats, and then doing some windmill ab work here. And uh, you know the top comment, LMAO, what the fuck is this shit, right? I'm a training video. And you know, that literally falls under what is approved for the sub here. This is a description of what's approved on the sub. Told me, how is this directly related to bodybuilding? Um, I'm building my body. What the fuck do you think I was doing at the gym, dude, if I wasn't bodybuilding? You retard. Question, 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 get motivated. This guy, your style, unique. He pretty much goes on to just say that I'm retarded. Reminiscent of a sick dying family pet, squandering for a nibble of steak. And then here I go on to say, you know, oh, I can do a 100 meter dash in 11 seconds, blah, blah, blah. I have all these records in the gym. And this guy, 0% chance you can do an 11 second meter dash. I coach track and field athletics and I'd like to call horse shit, LOL, right? Ha 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 ha. The fuck did I just watch? And then, you know, I started off like being very positive, but you know, when you post something and then within like 10 minutes of you posting it, you just get a shitload of people all of a sudden commenting and they're getting upvoted. And so, you know, I'm like trying to back myself up here. I'm not just going to sit here and take it. And I'm just like, fuck, I'm just a kid who lives in a small apartment. I use my phone to shoot. I upload exercise videos when I get a chance and I'm linking to all my other stuff, right? Uh, one guy here good for you for trying and keeping at it you've just posted in the wrong sub right well anyways you know i go on to explain pretty much everything and uh you know it's just frustrating when i think this is a place that i can post my stuff to to get some positive feedback for my work and i posted a while back on the sub and it actually got quite an upvote Right here, posted one month ago to the same sub, cardio, abs, and bullshit. It's a video of me doing the exact same stuff. You know, and then this guy saying, is this a fucking video of you working out in jeans? Like, who the fuck are you, dude? And they're all like that. Just fuckers. You know? And it's like, oh, yeah, I'll um, back myself up here. You're going to see right here just how close I can get. Um, it's a big difference without the ball, you know, because I can get up there. Like, that's not the issue here. Yeah, so I'm up there and I can pretty much do that consistently. Okay. This is advanced rating. These stupid motherfuckers. Who the fuck do they think they are coming at me? Yeah, get motivated, people. And, uh, you know, if you're wanting to go to the gym, don't let any of these motherfuckers ever make you think that you don't belong there because 
they're the ones who truly don't belong there, and I doubt that they are ever there in the first place. The gym for me has always been sort of like a brotherhood. I've been involved in athletics my entire life, and to see some of you motherfuckers, you know, I know what fuckers you guys were when, uh, you know, if ever you participated in sports, and that's why I'm not necessarily gonna fucking take anything you guys said to heart because you weren't ever part of the team. You're not a fucking part of the brotherhood. You know, the gym for me is a place where some of the strongest and smartest motherfuckers gather. And, uh, you know, when you get in an environment like that and you push yourself to the extreme, it becomes a very emotional environment. And I've been on some teams where, you know, we're coming to the fucking championships and everyone's fucking working their ass off and you touch someone in the wrong fucking way and the whole team explodes. And uh, deep down, a lot of the strongest motherfuckers that you'll find in these places are some of the most kind-hearted and caring and, you know, comedic people on the entire planet. And so for all of you to come out and misrepresent a place that I hold so near and dear to my heart, you know, I'm not gonna fucking let you biasly portray an entire peoples by this little shit post, this little shit show that you all felt like you had to be a part of here. So that's all I have to say. And uh, if I see you at the gym, you know, oh wait, I'm not gonna see you at the gym because I already know the type of people that are at the gym and it's not fucking you. This video was made in rebuttal to a recent post that I uploaded to a bodybuilding forum on Reddit. Now, I'm coming at you from an elevation of around 4778 at Utah State University campus. I'm doing this in some skateboarding shoes on a turf and I stopwatched the splits by my own hand with this watch here and uh, you know I can only imagine that if I was to have some actual assistance in regards to timing the event and I was recording on an actual track and filled track with some spiked sprinting shoes that I would be hitting you know low 11s and possibly even break the barrier into 
some uh, speeds of hitting 10 seconds per my 100 meter dash. Now, I don't know why everybody felt like they had to just come at me at that moment. Like, literally the post wasn't attacking anybody. It was just a post that said, get motivated. It was a training video. It didn't have anything that was extremely odd to see someone doing at the gym. I did some yoga. I hit the punching bag to warm up. I did some ladders. I then went and did some tire lifts outside because I love getting outside. I hate being confined to the gym. I like doing things which transition to real world applications like going and climbing a mountain, hunting, rock climbing, bouldering, all that stuff. I like to snowboard, surf, everything, all the above. And then all of a sudden I had all these fucking people come out of nowhere and it's like, they're like, why the fuck are you posting this here? When about a month earlier, I posted something pretty much exactly the same to what it was that I posted. And uh, I got positive reviews. It even got up to like five karma points. And you know, people were commenting, great job, keep it up. I love the motivation, you know? Good to see someone out there working hard. And I was like, oh hell yeah. Posted this and everyone's like, oh fuck you, fuck you. And then I was like, whoa, whoa, just cause I like to do exercises, which, you know, translate to me doing something outside, getting some sunlight and actual activities, which are applicable toward accomplishing, you know, practical goals outside of a confined, regulated and artificial space, you know? And so I commented, you know, after receiving a lot of negative feedback, a lot of other shit that I've done, you know, I've been in competitive sports my whole life. Four by one track, long jump, you know, was reaching somewhere around 15 meters in my long jump. Last time I did that. I'm sure it's well above that now because that was back clear in junior fucking high school, you motherfuckers. And then all of a sudden, all these motherfuckers saying that I shouldn't be posting shit on a fitness and athletics forum when just a few weeks earlier I was getting positive reviews. That's why I think that, you know, all the shit online, it just has to do with who comes across it first. And as soon as they themselves kind of like make an appearance on the actual post, then everybody else kind of follows form. And if the first person to actually comment is just a fucker, then everybody else who's a fucker likes to jump on the bandwagon. If somebody comments positively, then it kind of keeps all those fuckers away. But you know, on this video it didn't happen that way. And I had a fucker comment first and then, you know, 10 fuckers come along and then all of a sudden everyone's like, who the fuck is this kid? What the fuck's he doing? And it's like, you know, I do a lot of different shit. And uh, had a bunch of people saying, oh, I bet you can't hit that speed. Yeah, you best believe that when I'm on my fucking best and this isn't after, you know, a fucking hardcore exercise like I did yesterday, you know, the video that I uploaded and I have some assistance on the field or on the track that I'm hitting fucking speeds that you can even fucking dream of, you fucking pussies. So when you motherfuckers come at me, realize that I haven't had any, you know, formal training in the last 10 plus years, and I don't have a fucking personal nutritionist or a personal trainer, I can't afford that stupid shit. So I get out there and fucking push myself. I come up with my own workout routines, and so I am personally motivated, and I feel like I've done pretty damn good for literally getting out there pretty much by myself for the last 10 plus years. And to come at me and say that I'm not a fucking athlete just tells me that you don't know my fucking background at all. And uh, you probably didn't even watch the entire video. You're probably just bandwagoning on the whole fucking being a fucker train here because what you don't know is that, you know, not only was I consistently in athletic finals such as Wrestling probably being my top competitive sport that I was involved in, you know, at an academic level, um, competitively, you know, in city and statewide tournaments. Um, not only that, but, you know, 
I do a lot of other shit too. Like, what you probably don't know is that I won an academic, you know, accolade for genetics work in which I spent like three plus months in a laboratory all by myself sequencing the human genome. You stupid motherfuckers, come at me. I'm all about spreading positivity, but when you come at me acting like a motherfucker, then expect for me to fucking shoot flames back down the barrel that you're fucking pointing at me. Cause I'm not gonna just sit there and take that fucking shit from all you fucking shit talkers. And uh, you know, if you wanna try and fucking back yourselves up, go ahead, post a video online of you doing some fucking exercises and see if you can fucking back up your own shit talking because Literally, I'm coming out here without having done 100 meter dashes in a long ass fucking time. And I'm putting up some pretty fucking good times, you know, for doing that. So, fuck. You know, for somebody who follows me along on my social media, you'll know that I'm a pretty big believer in kind of negative and positive energies manifesting themselves. And I like to be a manifestation of this positive energy, but when you're being a motherfucker and coming at me, don't expect me just to sit there and take it. I'm gonna shoot some fucking fire back down the fucking barrel of your own gun that you're pointing at me. And I'm putting up some pretty fucking good times for, you know, not being cut up at the moment. I'm just coming out of winter, you know? I did all this in about a 30 minute period. So if you motherfuckers think you can get out there and do fucking better, then fucking have at it. Post your fucking shit. Let's get some competition going here. But you know, if you guys are gonna fucking talk shit, then you know, back that shit up because I didn't post anything that wasn't necessarily true about what it is that I've done. And I've kind of came out here today and fucking shown you that. Not to mention, I built my own fucking high performance computer in which I'm able to multi-stream on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, both my personal and business Facebook page at the same fucking time because I set up my own virtual server and just to piss you off all even more, I ride a fucking hoverboard around just so I can say fuck you to all you stupid motherfuckers who have a stereotype about individuals. Doing this all with the fucking crazy hairstyle going on because I know it's gonna piss you fucking haters off even more because I go around life way too much and see a lack of fucking personality when I'm going around because for some reason, people are fucking criticized for having a sense of self and a sense of expression. And uh, if you are some stupid motherfucker that, you know, spends all your time in the gym, I feel bad for you because while you're fucking wasting away in a confined space, I'm gonna be out rock climbing, surfing, snowboarding, longboarding, skateboarding, and uh, all sorts of other shit. So yeah, have fun being fucking stuck in the gym. And uh, you know, on one more note, I had some other motherfuckers that were saying, you know, the amount of weight that I can lift and all this other stuff wasn't impressive at all. Well, coming from the scientific background that I do, when you look statistically at the averages of the entire population, then yeah, I outperform pretty much 99% of the human individuals on population Earth. So suck it in comparison to my height and my body weight and my fat percentage, yeah. I outdo a lot of you motherfuckers. So everything that I said wasn't biased. It wasn't exaggerated. Everything I said, 
I can fucking back up. And if I haven't already posted videos of me doing said things, then be expecting a video coming out very shortly because I'm not one to go around and exaggerate about what it is that I can do. And especially when, you know, I have a lot of people coming at me and they're gonna expect me to put out results in regards to what it is that I'm claiming and there being some fucking dick holes on the interweebs, you know, 